Let's be clear about one thing. You started it, you sneak dissing pussy. <laughs> oh my God. I thought it was funny too. We already squashed this dude. What are you doing? Here's a backstory. A couple years ago, Tom Mc what up, Bus Man? We back okay. with another Bears and Bars video. I'm Casey. It's Court. Yo, we got Mac Lethal on the track. Damn, Tom McDonald is a Nazi. Damn, okay. Bus Man, we over here trying to record the Suicide Boys album because we just got it in the mail. And Mac Lethal out here dropping Tom yeah. disses. So you remember when we were watching the last Tom McDonald one, he was yeah. talking about he doesn't do diss tracks no more because he ruined somebody's career. Yeah. And we were asking about who that was that got their yeah. career ruined. Mm -hmm. Or well, Common said Mac Lethal got washed by Tom McDonald Damn. in the past. Yeah. So apparently he didn't like that. <laughs> yeah, so I guess now we're about to see what Mac Lethal, and this is like the first time I'm even hearing him because I right. don't Right, I don't think we know Mac was. Lethal. So yeah. BuzzFam, we're new to him, so if there's some background or some backstory that we don't know, let us know in the comments. We don't do research BuzzFam on purpose. So when you say, like, y'all should have known this or that, we don't do it yeah. on purpose because we like to be surprised. Yep. We like to engage with you guys in the comments. Yep. So drop it below what we need to know. Yep. But it sounds like he's going to tell us a little backstory. Yeah. Okay. So we're about to get it. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, Buzz fam. Let's do it. 22. We already squashed this dude. What are you doing? Here's a backstory. A couple years ago, Tom McDonald got his feelings hurt and made a track towards me. Tried to diss me in a rapping war. Tried to bait me into going back and forth, but I really didn't have the passion for it. So I made one song and I had to ignore it. I don't want to sound rude. I just think he's mad corny. I did it. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Okay. So he's setting Damn. the record straight. Or Damn. at least he's trying to. Yeah. So he coming in talking about like a couple years ago, Tom was trying to like bait me into some shit, trying mm -hmm. to go back and forth with all yeah. that. And I was like, I wasn't about it. So I did one track and left. Yeah. Yeah. And so I guess, you know, just like with it, I'm no response. I guess like everybody else is like taking it as, yo, he ruined this guy's career and, you know, yeah. didn't want to reply back. So I, hmm, okay. So I guess we're hearing his side. We're hearing the other mm -hmm. side of the story. Yeah. I like it. You know, I'm kind of curious. I think Mac Lethal was smart on this mm -hmm. because that Tom one, I feel like it was a little while back, right? Mm -hmm. Like a couple months ago. Never heard it. When all the other ones were, no, no, mm -hmm. no, not the main diss one. Mm -hmm. The last Tom McDonald one where he says he doesn't diss. Mm -hmm. but that was around the same time as all the other big disses were coming out. So I think Mac let that die down a little bit, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, not to get it, yeah. washed up in the yeah. in the hype or like, mm -hmm. in, like the, in the mix. Yeah. So I made one song and I had to ignore it. I don't want to sound rude. I just think he's mad corny. I didn't want to give it energy. A transphobic, homophobic, culture vulture rapping about white supremacy isn't worthy of facing me lyrically. But I'm getting Ooh. tired of watching this dude embarrass hip hop's history. And the other damn, damn, it's like that. Damn. Shoot. Oh man. Wow. That's that's sad, dude. He basically came at him for like everything. He's like. You are like everything that everybody hates in like nowadays society, right? Because yeah. you, you are unwilling to accept like the way people are and this and that, yeah. and like and trying you, to like um say that he's um homophobic or whatever, yeah, you transphobic know, and all this and shit. that, you know, and that like he is like I guess like Nazi ish or whatever because you know he stands up, you know, for you know his, his rights. So you know, right. I'm like I'm for his background, like for his you know ethnicity and everything, and like, he's you know. ruining like rap history. But now I'm curious, Buzz Fam, if, if Tom's going to come back at this because he yeah. said he doesn't do diss yeah. battles anymore because he already ruined somebody, mm -hmm. a.k.a. Mac Lethal. Yeah. Facing me lyrically, but I'm getting tired of watching this dude embarrass hip hop's history. And the other day he dropped a new song, and for some reason he was dissing me. Fine, fight contract sign. Normally I wouldn't pay this any mind, but you made a nine minute song about your personal life. Why the fuck you mention mine? I've been minding my business and buying some property. Why are you dissing me? Why you Dang. Dang, he says, I was minding my business. You Buying made a property, song. trying to do. Yeah. yeah, he said, you made a song, a nine-minute song about yourself. Why are you dissing me in it? Yeah. Uh-huh. That you made and you, why me. you say yeah. you don't do diss tracks. Yeah. Exactly. Mm. You take shots at me, man. Are you buying prescriptions again? Is it lines that you're sniffing? It's gotta be. Fuck it. Ding, ding. Let's begin. You got weak skin. We followed each other on IG. We DM'd. We even. Tom got on. <laughs> <laughs> Savage. Oh, yeah. Begin. You got weak skin. We followed each other on IG. We DM'd. We even. Agreed that we would be friends. Thomas, we already squashed it. Last time, I took the high road. This time, I'm getting toxic. 
First mm. off, your music sucks, you're goofy as fuck, your beats are trash. I bet a million dollars cash that I could easily beat your ass. Your girlfriend <laughs> is a skeezer with diseases, she got fleas and crabs. She used to go to Russell Simmons' house and eat his ass. No oh, whoa. 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 When he said he was going toxic, he was oh, not He was my not joking. God. Oh my God, dude. Bro. Yeah, so I know that um, she was a part of the um, Def Jam label, though, you know, but to like put that damn because like you know how um russell simmons yeah. you know like he owned def jam and damn wow dang bro damn she got fleas and crabs she used to go to russell simmons house and eat his ass <laughs> nova rockefeller known for rockefeller she was a groupie over at def jam and a hoe at rockefeller you nerdy yeah. cuck i wouldn't touch that dirty slut for 30 bucks you're not even so she was at you know, Def Jam, like the Rock too. Oh, look at it's it. a Rock, bro. Damn, that's cold. Yo, whoa. There's no, Yo. there's no way Tom can't respond to this. Mm -mm. There's no way. Yeah, yeah, man, he gonna respond to this. Damn, damn, Nova might respond to this. Oh yeah, oh yeah, dude. Don't put it past her either, <laughs> man. Because shoot, man, like she got some serious bars too. So damn. Holy moly, I was not ready for that. Mm -mm. You nerdy cuck, I wouldn't touch that dirty slut for 30 bucks. You're not even in the top 10 rappers, your girl is fucked. Oh my God. She's vaginally infected. I'll get Ooh. back to her in a second. First, I'm Ooh. smashing you on this record. I'll punch you Ooh. so hard you'll see three. Oh, I'll get back to her You're in a second. Even in the I'm top 10 rappers, rappers that she's messed with. Yeah. Wow. But he says, I'll get back to her in a second. I'm mm. smashing you on Damn. this record. So he's like, yeah, I'll wow. get back to smashing your girl wow. after I'm done smashing. Damn. Mm. And I'll get back to her in a second. First, I'm smashing you on this record. I'll punch you so hard, you'll see three of me. You'll say, hi, Dave. Hi, Dave. Hi, Dave. Half your fucking fan base wishes they could buy slaves. I donate my money to veterans. Okay, what you want, a peppermint? Don't complain about it, just do it. We're patting yourself on the back for the camera lens. You're just Doja Cat for not... So, your fans wish that they could buy slaves? So like he, they're going back to that whole like your fans are a bunch of like Nazis and racist, yeah, 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 prejudiced yeah. people and all this craziness. And then look at he's like, "You're Doja Cat for the Nazis." <laughs> <laughs> wow, damn, wow. Don't complain about it, just do it. Quit patting yourself on the back for the camera lens. You're just Doja Cat for Nazis, a feminine racist on every beat. They call you an anti woke rapper because your music puts everybody to sleep. Fuck everything that your lame ass do. If Dave Matthews had braids and a face tattoo and made a song called If I Was a Gay Black Jew, we would all be like, hey, that's you. Acting like you represent the blue collar working man, rocking army boots when you live in Woodland Hills and wear $5,000 Versace suits. You'll never fuck with Mac. Look at this blonde bitch surrounded by shirtless African American actors. What you about to get gang? Banged in an episode of Black, your fan. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, bro! Wow, yo, you really pissed Mac off. Damn, damn, damn man, you coming in hard, man. It's like you know that, dude. Yo, yo, my Mac, this dude, is, and this freaking is some, some Mac on Mac crime. Mac, <laughs> Mac, Mac on Mac crime. Mac on Mac crime. Damn, oh, man. Yeah, man, that's what we call this, like a Mac on Mac. <laughs> <laughs> Mac and Mac. Oh, man. Surrounded by shirtless African-American actors. What you about to get gang banged in an episode of Black? <laughs> your fans cheer when planes fly over Gaza dropping bombs. I'm a 52 year old soccer mom. I hate rap, but you're awesome, Tom. I'm a fake fraud, poser, liar, charlatan, and grifter at heart. You have no fucking dignity. You'll do anything. You know, you Charlington know. And Oh. I will say, I will say mm. there's some truth to what he said about the comment mm. section yeah. on Tom's videos. Mm. Like, like, I, I don't, don't even rap, like rap, but I but, like your music. But I like you, you know. Yeah. Wow. Damn. Fraud, poser, liar, charlatan, and grifter at heart. You have no fucking dignity. You'll do anything just to get on the charts. <laughs> Bitch, I'm a star. Kicking these bars. Burning his body. I'll rip it apart. Tom? Did you call yourself the white version of Kendrick Lamar? <laughs> Talking like you kicked down doors for the indie movement, what? bitch. You stole that same <laughs> blueprint. <Wait>, what? <laughs> okay. Okay, finally, a rapper is saying something that matters. Got fire. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Wow. <laughs> That's a bold claim. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. 
Or? Talking <laughs> like you kicked down doors for the indie movement, bitch. You stole that same blueprint from rhyme sayers and strange music. I paved your road, real indie since 01. Now I'm Marvin Gaye's father. I'm killing my own son. <laughs> Whoa. Damn, oh bro. my God. Damn, bro. Dang. Dang. That was that was a tough metaphor right there, man. Damn. He's got four and a half more minutes of this. Damn, man. Now I'm Marvin Gaye's father. I'm killing my own son. Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, There's no. a story about a boy named Tom. <laughs> he had a rich dad and a racist mom. <laughs> Wait, is he saying that Tom lied? Because Tom said that he came from some humble beginnings, but he's yeah. saying he had a rich dad. Mm-hmm. So I don't know if that's true, but yeah. we're going to let us know. I have no idea. Nova. Daddy. Here, Nova. Daddy. Come here, girl. Sit. Aw, good girl. Here's a treat. Daddy. Here's the truth that you can't run from. No can do told me when I'm fighting monsters, don't let it make you become one. Your ego's too big, it's gotta be deflated. Trying to say political rap is a genre you created? You gotta be fucking kidding me. You ever heard of Ice-T, Ice Cube, Immortal Technique, X-Clan, or Public Enemy? Of course you haven't. You know nothing. You know what's funny is when we <laughs> talked about that, is we were like... I don't know who else does like political raps, and then we only mentioned old school rappers like yeah. you just did. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, man. Because it's like we only, yeah, yeah, man. We only talked about the like pox. We only talked about you know like, Cube and yeah, you know P E K R S one. Yeah. And, yeah. and I was like, but today I was like, I don't know too many political yeah. rappers today. Yeah. Yeah. But that was, yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. Ice T, Ice Cube, Immortal Technique, X Clan, or Public Enemy? Of course you haven't. You know nothing about the culture. Second Amendment, right guns coming about the holster. Put the pistol in your mouth. Name one song off of Illmatic before I pull the trigger. A car. You want to be American so bad that you won't. Eat. So wow, wow. So so with that right there. Well, I know, but I, I no, I guess to Tom's defense, like I've heard him say that his idols were. Pac, you know, and, and like and like on um, Red Hot, I don't know, like it was like um, Pac, Pac Nirvana, and I don't know, like you said anything about Nas. I know that um Adam Calhoun said something about, about Nas I'll being think, like his yeah. big, yeah. So so that's why I keep tying in that. Hey, name something off of Illmatic, Illmatic like name yeah. a song off of Illmatic. <laughs> it's only nine songs, so you got it. <laughs> or I pulled the trigger. Wow. You want to be American so bad that you won't even rep your own flag, and now you're getting toe tagged on every single song. You use that same dead flow. Your girls like Emily Willis, a brain dead hoe. I should have known that you're a damn snake. The type of person that'll look right in a man's face and offer him a handshake. Call a truce, declare peace on the landscape, then diss his family life just to entertain your fan base. On God mode, trying to rap like Jesus, but in real life, you act like Judas with pussy cat like movements. I feel like Caesar getting stabbed by Brutus, but I got oh, oh, like Caesar getting stabbed in the back but by you Brutus. Act like Judas with Yo, pussy cat type movements. Oh man, Yo, man, lethal man, he going off, man. Yeah, he going off for <laughs> sure. Dude, he, he going said, off. He, he going said, We off. had a truce and you stabbed me in the back, back. you snake. Oh man, wow, damn. Or posting some clickbait family rap like hardship. Damn. Hmm. Wow. You act like Judas with pussy cat like movements. I feel like Caesar getting stabbed by Brutus. But I got whiplash, so drums make me smack my students. The YouTube diss tracks, they really yeah. ain't my vibe. Uh, when I back. What? Knox Hill will explain this. Did you see that at the bottom? No, I didn't see that. Oh, okay, no. Hold, on, hold, hold up. Hold on, hold on. This with pussy cat like movements. I feel like Caesar getting stabbed by Brutus. But I got whiplash, so drums make me smack my students. You- so I got whiplash, so students will make me smack my students. Yeah, and like I said, Knox, Knox Hill, Hill will explain, explain this. this. So apparently, Knox Hill knows something about this whiplash bar. Hmm. Now I'm gonna have to go watch Knox Hill's reaction <laughs> or Bus Fam drop it in the comments. <laughs> I'm sure Knox will drop something at yeah. some point, but I don't know what that means. You? Yeah. Yeah, man, I know that Knox has to drop something at some point because, you know, yeah, like I'm using Covering I mean, he's in this realm. Yeah. Yeah, He's like rapping and doing all this stuff Mm -hmm. and the breakdowns and then obviously like he's a rapper himself doing it. (laughs) 
Caesar getting stabbed by Brutus. But I got whiplash, so drums make me smack my students. The YouTube diss tracks, they really ain't my vibe. When I battle a rapper shit, I'd rather do it live. I'll bet 50,000 bucks to the charity of your choice that you won't look me in the eyes and put clarity in your voice and say the things about me that you said in all your diss tracks. When I'm a foot away from you and you might just get bitch slapped. Shit, we could battle on King of the Dot. Your girl knows all those dudes. She's seen all their cocks. We could battle up in Canada, right in your hometown. I'll let you pick the city and venue it goes down. And I promise I'll get a bigger applause than you. Because in hip hop, there ain't a bigger fraud than you. I went on tour with. Damn, bro. He says, pick a place, pick a time, pick a city. We, I'm like, you ain't gonna say that shit to my face. Wow. Dude. Yo, man. Man, I, I think that the re, like the I would reply, say I would say he's not you know, going crazy, right? Like, like he ain't going. Cra- I mean, dude, like double but, entendre, like sneak this, and he's just going direct. Yeah, I mean, like, it's like just, 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 dude, like ain't no sneak this, it's just like he's like direct. It's just like uh, uh, keep my like, name out your. He's just like stabbing, mouth. stabbing, stabbing, <laughs> stabbing. That's yeah. what he doing right now. Damn, I wonder if this. You this know, is like the Will Smith the reply. slap across the face. Like, yeah. I want everybody to know yeah, who's man. doing this right now. Yeah, yeah, man. So, so it was like, I'm question is now, you know, do you think that Tom and Nova is going to do a joint track against Mac? Or they're going to probably do, do their own separate tracks? So that's what I'm, like, trying to wonder right I, now. I'm worried if they did that, that Mac would come back at him and mm-hmm. say like you need a chick on your track to do this yeah. and you need Tom on your track in order to get numbers that are like yeah. right like I feel like if yeah. they go together yeah yeah man can, I don't know I think like either way like they go separate they go together or whatever I still think it's gonna be oh yeah and she has to come up with her own song in order to you know come at me you know y'all gotta att- I mean dude like either way it's going to be I think you know, that he's they. Gonna say something. I think that they need to come up with like do like a K dot right and come up with like eight songs in a row and both of them just back to back just keep dropping them like day after day after day and drop and another and another yeah because this is like especially at Nova, dude yeah yeah I know right dude that was unprovoked. He's like she's seen all 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 they jumps yeah all of them. Thanks. Bigger applause than you Because in hip-hop, there ain't a bigger fraud than you I went on tour with D12, those dudes are my new friends They showed me some video you made for Eminem They told me they were in the studio with Slim When he watched it, he cringed and he cut it off 30 seconds in Eminem doesn't like you, he does not respect you You made a love ooh. song about him begging him to peg you Have you? Ooh, ooh, and I remember us reacting to that right there yeah. Now, if he... Oh, okay, so, well, of so, course, D12, M... Co- co- I'm okay, I'm okay. Yeah, 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 I'm, yeah, like, exactly. I'm close as road dogs. But if this is going to be backed up, like if he could get receipts on this, saying, I yeah, mean, like, like D12, to prove this, yeah. D, D12 showing them, look, look at this, you know, or right. whatever. And well, but what I'm wow. wondering because, uh, because Tom, I'm pretty sure if I remember right, he bought that beat from M and used it. Yeah, that's what I remember. He bought it for like a hundred grand or something like that mm-hmm. and used it. To try to like get Eminem's attention, I think what is my guess, right? And mm-hmm. so I'm wondering if it's the same song that D12 or he D12 mm-hmm. was in the studio watching that song with. Yeah, yeah, but he's saying that D12 say that Eminem cringed, and I mean, and like I would say like to be fair, Eminem probably cringing at like 99% of rap that comes across his desk. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, like there's yeah. not a lot that impresses Eminem anymore yeah because he eminem thinks mgk is trash yeah and yeah, mgk is not dope. trash <laughs> right like MGK's that's dope. what i mean like i yeah, love yeah, him right yeah, like yeah but i feel like there's not a lot of artists out there that yeah, are man, it's just like his um, select few like you know that he, he likes his bar is so high that it's just like 
Yeah. All right, whatever. Next. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> yeah. Doesn't like you. He does not respect you. You made a love song about him begging him to peg you. Have you noticed that publicly he's never even mentioned it? I'm sorry, buddy. I know that's not how you envisioned it. You thought he'd call you like, hey, Tom, it's Slim Shady. You're so controversial. How are you this crazy? You want to make a song about how transgender men are pretend ladies and all the live ladies having mixed babies? And how the Mexican border is being invaded by woke Palestinians causing inflation? We'll call it white boys part 12 it'll be awful oh, and the grammy no. goes to eminem and tom mcdonald I'm so oh my oh, god wow. bro oh my god oh, man because didn't he make that song white boys yeah right like yeah and so he's like we'll call it white boys part 12 and like do all this <laughs> shit and like mm-hmm. damn yeah and he's like coming through like the palestinian bars yeah. and the transgender bars and all yeah. this stuff went, which is kind of wild like Obviously, I don't think Tom thought most of what he just said, right? But it's it's kind of wild because Eminem is like like fairly progressive in like his in his like thought process. Like he raps about some crazy stuff in the past, right? But he's like pretty pretty liberal in most of his like yeah. thought process in the class. Yeah. So I don't think that of a math do I fuck shit ass bitch. Right. But it's like it's like he's friends with Elton John and like all these people, right? So it's not like he. He is like anti, like woke establishment yeah. kind of like thought yeah. process. Yeah, it's just like he had lyrics about um, Elton John, but then you know, yeah, but like um, I'm Elton John played the piano for the song "Stand" at yeah, the Grammys, yeah, so, exactly. you know, right? Yeah, so so it was just yeah. Water under the bridge. Yeah. Sorry that you didn't get to do a song with your hero. At least you got to do a song with Prince Hero, the dude that censored Candace Owens' views quick. And he said that rap music isn't real music. And he tried to say the pussies aren't supposed to get wet. That song was so controversial and over the edge. I'm kidding. Nobody cares about your facts and your feelings. You make music for people that storm the Capitol building. You make rap tunes for white trash inbred people that snort crank in dirty ass gas station bathrooms. People that shoot. AR 15s in classrooms. The now, ne- I'm gonna warn you, Mac Lethal, the hog fam go heavy. Wow. And you coming at him right now. And then, remember, oh, remember, the remember like Nova saying that um, he don't like the Wu Tang or whatever. Oh my God. Wait, wait, Nova said who doesn't like the Wu Tang? No, that I'm um, Tom didn't like the Wu Tang. Did she say that? Remember, it was on like they love song on that I'm um, Gang Gang song. Like um, she was saying that I'm um, Tom don't like the Wu Tang and like I'm um, Tom was like, that right there. I don't remember that, but that, I remember that right there. I'm like, I gotta go back uh, and you watch can't, it. You can't. I mean, well, well, like, hey, um, you could like or not like who you want, but man, Ghostface, Jizza, Jizza, man, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Bro. okay. Mm-hmm. But I, but still, he's yeah. yeah. Max going at Tom's fan base. Tom's yeah. fan base is pretty devout. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that's like not loyal. That, not that that's a loyal. Michael necessarily cares about mm-hmm. Tom's fan base or not. Yeah, I'm just like, mm-hmm. that's a yeah, them they are strong, some stands. Man, they strong. <laughs> they strong. Yes, gas station bathrooms, people that shoot AR-15s in classrooms that never heard a Nas Del Wu or Black Moon. You make music for people that hate yeah, black yeah, dudes, dude. people that huff Ooh. gas fumes, got barbed wire tattoos, people that say the N word while playing Call of Duty, people that buy a case of Bud Light just to shoot it, incels that are terrified of sex, and people that pay money to be verified on X. People that say, now normally I don't like rap, but this Tom McDonald dude is great because he ain't black. I rewrote this this three times, kept throwing out the verses. Wow, bro. Wow. Well, he's just like. Um, people that don't know about Wu Tang, Nas, or Black Moon, and like um, those are well, obviously, yeah, and like I'm um, Black Moon, like another you know well respected you know mm-hmm. freaking freaking I'm um, hip hop you know like freaking I'm um, underground group and damn, damn yeah, so right. it seemed like I'm um, Mac Lethal like know his people like he know yeah he knows he know his people yeah. okay. A McDonald dude is great because he ain't black. I rewrote this disc three times, kept throwing hey, out. What the- did that shirt say? Nova is a mutt. <laughs> Wow. And in, in MAGA. Yeah. 
I don't know. That's some like Russian shit or something. Uh, yeah, so. <laughs> Tom Donald dude is great because he ain't black. I rewrote this disc three times, kept throwing out the verses. Punch lines weren't cut and it needed substance and some purpose. I realized I needed to try to cut beyond the surface and instead of murdering you, maybe I could be of service. You constantly just brag about the ways you feel yourself. It's obvious you're losing your battle with mental health. Tried to fill the emptiness in your soul by getting wealth, but the money, fame, Louis and Gucci, it didn't help. You need to go to Balenciaga and get a belt. Put it round your neck, kick out the stool, then kill yourself. You need Damn. to put a gun to your head, then drill yourself. Cause to yourself, you've never revealed yourself. I swear to God, I know record label execs that managed you, represented you, brought you a couple checks. They told me all sorts of shit about you. How you like to. To be continued. Maybe your best course would be to tread lightly. Oh. So, like it, look like. So like it looked like, wow, wow. Buzz fam, you're gonna have to let us know which tracks were in the previous beef, so we can go back and check those out. Yeah. So we get a little history lesson. Wow. So drop that in the comments below, because this says to be continued. First mm. of all, and second of all, he just said tread lightly in yeah. some some Darth Vader voice. So it's just like so damn. he's like, so like warning Lito you, got some just let it die. Lined up. <laughs> he's saying let it die right there. Yeah. So this is the bait. Mm -hmm. This is the trap. So we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Damn. Okay. Okay. All right. We'll be here for it. If y'all new here, welcome to the BuzzFam. Hit the subscribe button. Yep. <laughs> see you on the next. Peace. Peace.